guys, today I have a new video for you, yay! Um, also before I get started, I have cut my hair and I have dyed it, I have layers, shorter and side bags. Like I used to have a couple of years ago I think. And in the last video I did, I didn't mention it but I had already dyed my hair then, so yes. Also, I do still have a bit of a cold, so we can ignore the fact that I might sound weird. But anyways, today I am going to be doing a room tour! I haven't, um, I've lived in England for about a year now, over a year now, and I haven't done a room tour, so I thought, why not do one now? And I haven't actually really ever done a proper room tour on this channel. I did do one in India, which was awful, because I did it on my iPad, and I didn't figure out, I hadn't figured out a lot of stuff then, so it was awful. There's a helicopter. I change my room around quite a bit, quite often. So my room doesn't change the same way for too long. Like, I think the longest I can get my room... Oh, my pillow's breaking. I think the longest um, that I've kept my room in like one certain type of thing could be up to like six months. But I do tend to change it around a bit because I like changing and I hate it when something's just always the same. So yeah. So my room does change quite a bit but this one's mostly for like autumn let's just say. Room tour autumn 2015. So yes, let's get started. So this here is my door. This is actually my door on the inside of my room. It's just the same door on the outside no one really cares. So here I have a hook these were in the wall, like in the door already. This hook has nothing on it. This hook, um, actually behind this, I have this chain necklace which has a hair tie and a bunch of random charms on it, which just I needed to put somewhere in the back there. And then I have my Hobbit calendar here, put on September with an orc. And then here I have my light switch, which I don't use because um, I always flipped it, which would have been terrible. So, or but I don't use this because I actually have a remote for my lamp so if I switch that it will just kind of like turn off the lamp altogether so I can't even use the remote so I tell people not to touch it yes let's move this way so my door is over there and then here is this cupboard yep just there and on it these are like the over door ones I put this hooks there's five hooks they have red red and blue and then I just have most of my bags hanging here because I just happen to own tons of bags and then um, these are interesting latches these doors you just like flip open this one's actually stiff but I don't use this um, well I do but I just don't go in it I just have some folders up there I think there's some fabric in there some more folders, a drum, a scarf random stuff and then there's a boiler which is why I don't use this because there's a boiler in here so the floor especially in front of this is always extremely hot we move this way where I have the rest of my cupboards this is a double door cupboard so it's got the same latch here but it just opens up both doors so we open up one and my camera stand is in the way and then we open up two so at the top there's just a shelf then I just have some shelves on this one I keep shorts and skirts and then t-shirts and tank tops on this one I have a basket which has like really random stuff in it I think it has like um, beach stuff but then it also has like super winter stuff for like downhill skiing, caps, so there's some belts there I have my EF graduation cap thing back there from when I went to France and my onesie and then as we go down this is going to be kind of impossible because I'm not going to move my stand down here. I have all my long sleeve shirts and my hoodies and things and it's really messy because I just kind of throw them in. Then down here I have a basket. I don't know where this basket is from but it just has all my pyjamas in it and they are super mess too. And these cupboards, both these cupboards here they were built in so yeah. Then here I just have all my hanging stuff. Here you can't actually see it. Let me take it out. I have my makeup, my makeup hanger. Oh. Then I just have some school trousers, which I don't actually wear. School skirts, that does not belong there. Oh well, school skirt, school jumper, 
dress, another dress, another dress, another dress, another dress, school shirts, school shirts, school shirts, I have a lot of school clothes, a uh, shirt, a really old school dress but I really liked it so I kept it, but it doesn't fit me, um, a really random shirt with everyone's names from my old school, another shirt, my scouts jacket, which actually still fits me which is really surprising, uh, my blazer, hoodie, 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 empty hangers, um, some of my baby clothes, <laughs> I keep really weird stuff, Another shirt with everyone from one of my really old schools signed, and then this one with scout scarves and medals, and my Merlin pass, which is actually expired. So, yeah. And then as we go down over here, I have my all my sports clothes really on top of this, and this is a um, what do I call it? It's like a storage thing from Argos. It has three baskets. I have like underwear, bikinis and bras and then like I think tights and woolen socks. And then in this basket which is from somewhere I don't know I keep my trousers because I don't actually own that many. Even the ones I'm wearing now are stolen from my mum. And then in this basket back here which you guys can't really see this is from um, I think it's a local place called Izzy. They sell really cheap random stuff and I just keep my socks in here and then really back here I just have, wait where's the other one? Oh they're both there. I have these two posters I painted but I can't hang them up anywhere so they're kind of just at the back. At the back and I also have an umbrella and my tripod case. So my bed but over here I have my billabong backpack, my guitar on its stand which is really wonky for some weird reason don't know why and then one of my handbags which you kind of can't see one of my handbags from new look so then we just have my bed here which actually also doubles as like a sofa the bed is from a finished shop which i can't remember but on this end um that pillow is from a finished shop that I actually won in a raffle. These two are custom made. This one is from Cargo, I think. Um, my little kangaroo rat or gerbil soft toy is from Toys R Us, I think. Is it? No, Hamley's. Um, that little monster I got from my brother. This one's my first toy ever. And this um, blanket or this fluffy blanket thing is from Ikea I'm pretty sure and then at this end my two pillows I have absolutely no idea where they're from and the pillowcases I stole from my parents and my duvet thing is I think custom made I'm not sure and then above it I have a cork board which I think is from Ikea I want to say then, next to my bed we have my windows, and actually next to my bed I also have my nightstand, I should have covered that up, but here, oh you can't even see it, but here I have a picture of me and my friends from Finland, which I'm now going to turn down because you're not allowed to see that, um, in a picture frame from Ikea. My uh, cream lamp is from Argos, I have my book that I'm currently reading and my phone and then in the actual stand, the door opens the wrong way from my bed but yeah, up here I just have some medicines and deodorants and some hair ties and body lotions, here I have my sweet tooth shelf which literally has is full of sweets and down there I just have some makeup bags, travel toiletry bags and so, and my phone cases, because I don't actually have that many. And then on my windowsill I have a ballet trophy, a Crete Cree goat uh, from Greece, um, a Crete actually, this ceramic bunny which I actually got from a charity shop here like years ago, this mini Big Ben which is actually like in the wrong place, um, this jar thing which is probably from my, wow look at look at what the sun has done to the color which is probably from ikea it just has some random cards in it this um box which i keep money in which is from some asian country i don't remember this photo it's not actually a photo it's a 
thing it's painted right onto a piece of wood someone made that for me I think then I have this red knitted thing from my grandma and in that on the top of that this is actually a water bottle cut in half which is some beads in it some twine wrapped around it and a pretty much dead rose but it looks pretty and especially for autumn that's like perfect then I have this other jewelry box jewelry box and that is actually also meant for jewelry but I don't keep any I just have some studs and earrings in there and then in the top I just have my bigger earrings which I hardly ever use and then this she I can't say it an Aries seashell from Greece um, then I have this jewelry holder from Yusuku which is a finished shop I actually remember that well I have some necklaces hanging here these are the only ones I actually own some of my earrings I wear the most my rings and behind that my bracelets and watches and then I have this bucket it's actually meant for gardening um, from the from Poundland and um, what I actually keep in here is all my gum so this is full of my gum and then also up there there's a built-in hook that was on there and I put my dream catcher there which I got from Greece and then my curtains are this flowery pattern which were here when we moved in so I don't know where they're from then from my windows we move on to my desk area which is a lot so yes um, on the floor I just have a wire cable stuff because my room is short on sockets um, back there you can just see that little pink thing that's actually um, sand that I use for my hamsters toilets and then in this cupboard in this cupboard I just have some random stuff at the back I have my nail polishes some makeup I hardly like I never use um, my markers um, a little coin thing um, some rubbers and a protractor and then down at the bottom I have a box in the back with random stuff in it fit temporary tattoos my old diaries that type of stuff then I have my CDs and then I have all my DVDs that are like mine because I bought them or I got them and I hate keeping them with the other DVDs downstairs because they are mine and then I just have some random notebooks here because I couldn't find any other space for them and then as we move on up on my desk there's my radio which is I have no idea where it's from um, it's really really old like the antenna's broken so I can't actually listen to the radio I just play CDs on it and I actually keep it there just for how it looks um, then I have this uh, pencil holder that I actually made by myself it's again another half of a bottle where I really like doing that and it's just got glitter on it it just has my pens and pencils in it sorry my camera thing is really really stiff well there we go now it's loose um, not really. Um, then I have this. What is that called? It's a magazine holder, paper holder thing. It just has um, some notebooks in it, all my post it notes, that type of stuff. And then I have two more of those, but in black. The, what, there is actually two there. The further back one has like random notebooks in it and just that type of stuff. And the one at the front has all my school notebooks and some index cards at the bottom as you can see and on my desk actually right now I just have a magazine from Parrish that my dad brought for me it's in French so I'm going to read that um, my own calendar, my school planner and a book, a school book and then um, up there I just have a painting which has a cross on it that cross is actually made out of wire I think um, I got it from my aunt, no my uncle and his wife's like yeah and then behind there you can see is a folder which is empty right now and then back there I have my whiteboard which is from WH Smith there's a photo of me and my best friend when we were little yay then I have my Harry Potter Legends book in Finnish and my Harry Potter I don't know what it is in English then I have all my Sarah J Maas books The Assassin's Blame, Throne of uh, Glass, Crown of Midnight, Air of Fire, Queen of Shadows and A Court of Thorns and Roses I have my Prefect badge because I'm a Prefect in school and then I have all these cute little Throne of Glass badges I have there's six of them oh no wait there's seven of them and then A Court of Thorns and Roses badge and then I have this mirror which is from Ikea and then under my mirror, well, well done I have stuff in the way I have that little snow globe which is actually from 
uh, Canada, my friend got it for me, so thanks. And then I have my Amethyst Rock from Lapland. And then my lamp is from Ikea. Then I have this photo frame. And a picture that I created in a dark room when I went to visit a college. And the photo frame I got from my aunt as a confirmation gift. Then I have my little Starbucks mug. Um, that is a reusable one. Then I have my Minions tissue box which I got from Superdrug. No, Super... Superdrug, yeah. Then I have another one of those red things and a candle of friendship which I got from my friend for my birthday. So thanks and it smells like vanilla, yay. And I have a blob of blue tack on top of it for some weird reason. Then I have the lip gloss I'm wearing currently and my remote for my lamp slash fan. Yay. And then on my table I just have this top model thing. I just don't have anything else so I use that and it just it just works. This drawer here and in here I just have um, my laptop, I'm actually taking my camera in that, um, some paper, some pencils, my quill, um, some ring binders, some tape, some lip balm, um, my headphones, um, other headphones, a mirror, just really random stuff. And then in this one, actually in front of this, I keep my backpack, which looks like this. It's from Eco City. And then here at the back, I just have painting supplies because I don't actually paint anymore that much, but I just still keep them. I have all my perfumes and um, a notebook, my cooking book. I actually write recipes in that, a pseudo cookbook and a brain workout book. And then in this bottom bit, I just have a bunch of books and a photo album and this part did also have a door like the other one but we took it off and I'm not going to go through the books but if you guys want a bookshelf tour give this video a thumbs up. Also I have my chair here which actually has two soft ink cushions on it because I don't know where I got them from but this black one and then this grey one I just keep them both on it because it keeps my... it keeps this it's soft okay um, and my chair's from Ikea oh yeah my desk is also from Ikea and my nightstand is from Ikea <laughs> no we don't have a problem with Ikea and then next to my desk I have my bookshelf wow yeah and then there's a shoe box which is full of food and a couple of other things for my hamsters and my bookshelf is from Ikea I actually own two but the other one's in my sister's room and usually here I would also have my hamsters here because um, they're in two separate cages so I keep their cages like that and they kind of cover that box but they're downstairs right now because their wheels, uh, their running wheels are broken so they squeak and make a lot of noise so I can't sleep if they are in my room so yes and, and then in the middle of my room my backpack is just there well well done I have my mat it's like a nice darker cream color I really like it and I think it's from Ikea. I really want to say Ikea, so we'll probably go with Ikea. And it actually goes under my bed because there's not enough space to have it. Because there's my desk already here. And then my bed, so it goes under my bed. And if you were wondering what I have under my bed, I have my guitar case, some weights, and this box full of all my hair stuff. Um, and another bag, but pretty much that's it. And then my lamp. That is my lamp. There's a lamp and there's a fan. And then like I said, I have my controller to control it. I can turn on a light, I can dim it, I can put the fan off or on low, medium or high. Or anything like that. So, yeah. That was my room. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a big thumbs up if you did. Comment down below if you have any video recommendations. Subscribe if you haven't already done so. Check out my vlog channel where I've been uploading my summer vlogs. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! They say I'm trapper. They say I'm mad. They say I'm evil. And I'm glad. Don't be more good. Don't be wrong. Your worst nightmare. Can't take me home. So I have some mischief. In my blood. Can you leave me? I don't get my blood. They think I'm callous. I love that. I feel so useless. I'm so